Hi everyone, this is Ashley with CT Arena Digitals. I'm going to show you today how to use the Twinkle Light Overlays in Photoshop. Um, I have two images open. I have one with a darker background, and then I also have um, a Cake Smash backdrop open on white. Um, I'm going to do the dark background first, and I already have the files open that I want to use. Um, I'm going to use the Gold Twinkle on both of them, just because that's um, my editing style, but all of these in silver will be included. Um, as well. So first I'm going to go over to this image. It's the overlay that I have open that I want to use. Um, go up to select all, edit and copy, and paste into a layer above my image. And now this is the biggest question I get all the time. Um, it is supposed to be black. All you have to do is go over to your blending mode, which is over here in your layers panel. Change it from normal to screen and then go ahead and reposition it where you want it, adjust the size. Um, you can adjust the opacity, the opacity, I'm sorry, if you need to um, or want to, but I like to keep it at full um, opacity. So obviously we're going to want to brush this off, as, off of our subject, so make sure that the overlay layer is selected. Um, create a layer mask. Go over to your brush, make sure that um, black is selected, 100% opacity, 100% flow, um, up to you what size brush you want to use. I'm going to zoom in on this little cutie and then just go ahead and brush it off. I don't want any of this um, light on him either actually brushed a little bit too much of that off. So if you need to brush anything back on, switch from from a black brush to a white brush, and then you can brush just brush it right back on. Okay. Super simple. Before, after, and that's it for that one. Now for this one, I want to use two of my overlays because I have one with that goes over the doors, but I also want it across the middle. Um, and I could um, copy and paste or use a clone tool to do that, but I'm just going to use two different overlays. Um, so first I'm going to apply this one. Select all, copy, paste, change the blending mode to screen, resize. looks good there and like I said so there's a little bit of gaps on the side and there's a gap right here I'm just gonna use another overlay copy and paste it change the blending mode to screen and just fill that in now there's some edges on um, this one that I want to um, get rid of. So I'm again going to create a layer mask. Use a black brush at 100% opacity. And I'm going to get rid of those ones right there. Um, and now if you wanted more lights in the middle, you could add another overlay um, and just erase parts of those. Um, or you could just simply um, highlight the layer Go to your clone tool and you could individually um, just take them from um, somewhere else and just manually paint them on. There's a couple of different options for that. Um, so before, after. And that's it. Super simple. 